My favorite part of the NFL offseason? That's easy. Rob Gronkowski stories. Sure, it's optional. Let's be honest, the NFL offseason sucks. Free agency, the draft, OTAs, boring! All that stuff is just roster talk and speculation until the season finally starts in the fall. That's why I'm thankful for one Robert Gronkowski, the NFL's bro king of good times, and a man not bothered with trivial things like self-awareness and reading ability. Whether he's going on a multi-state spring break tour, hanging out with porn stars, or just getting extra off-season surgeries, Gronk always makes for good copy. Thank you, you beautiful idiot man-child. Top five off-season gronktivities in 2015, and note that it's only early June. This list will change. Number five, birthday blowout in Vegas. Pretty good, but also pretty predictable, and not as exciting as in previous years because number four, Gronk has a girlfriend, and hold on to your horses, but she's a former Patriots cheerleader. I know, crazy, right? Seriously, I would pay money to hear their conversations. So you like stuff? Yes, that's cool. Number three, sporting events. Not only will Gronk drive the pace car at a NASCAR race, he also attended the Kentucky Derby wearing this. Whew. Don't look directly at that. I think I just lost a good chunk of my brain cells. Number two, movies. Gronk appeared in Entourage. He also shot scenes for a movie called You Can't Have It. And listen, lady, it's no good pointing a gun at Gronk. He used to practice with Aaron Hernandez. And of course, number one with a bullet, Gronk's reaction to Deflategate. One thing you can deflate, these nuts!